Greetings, programs. This is Wretch, and welcome back to Arslan, the Warriors of Legend. Last time we saw that Isfahan does not mess about when it comes to the defense of his brother's holdings. And uh, that's probably a good thing to know for future reference. But now we're moving back to the present era, where Arslan and his army are finally leaving Peshawar Fortress and making the move toward Ekbatana, to take the throne of Pars to secure it for Arslan and bring this era of chaos to an end. So let's go ahead and see what obstacles get in their way. ひとまず我々が目指すのはここ。近くを通過することになるね。はて、ここに城塞などあっただろうか。茶数部長。ルスタニア側が最近新たに建設した城塞だ。航路の要点を抑え、こちらの動向を監視するのが目的だろう。ふん。ギスカールとかいう男も一応
There's Daryun. So Narsis sent uh, Tus, or excuse me, sent Daryun to watch them because uh, Daryun knew what they were going to do. Actually, let's go ahead and get um, Daryun equipped with, uh, where's it at? The battle for Narsis because him having more offensive power is always welcome. Defeat the Lusitanian forces that are in front of the castle. Sounds like a plan to me. That's one general. Who's next? Oh, we got assault captains? Okay. Ooh. Oh, another assault captain. And another general. They're coming out of the woodwork. There we go. And... Oh, we got some more that just showed up. That is no bueno, my friends. Messengers are advancing toward Clements. Oh, we can't get that gate open yet. Probably when we take out these guys. We got him in a nice little corner here, so that's good. Let's uh, keep on musuing. Just keep laying the hate down. Alright, that's another general down. Holy crap, that is a lot of assault captains and such. I would really like a rush that I could actually reach. That would be amazing. The good news is this is going to be a lot of gold and a lot of skill cards for us to enjoy. And due to chaining the combos, I keep on getting my Musu. Very weird to see an Assault Captain with a defense bar. I think these are the last guys we have to kill, though, so... Let us uh, focus on the task at hand. Alright. That's another one down. Oh, we still had two more. Holy crap. Come here, guys. You need to just go ahead and die. I think we're getting to the point that some of these battles may actually be increasing in difficulty, which is awesome. That's kind of what we've been looking for. But these are one of the this is one of those games that if you're not careful, you can lose really quick out of nowhere. But you need to pay attention to kind of everything that's going on. Okay, let's get on the horse. The messengers have reached Clements. That is not good. Okay. Drop down here. And intercept the main force. Okay, we took care of them. Where's... Where do we go? Ah, okay. We were waiting on someone. Like Mothru. We gotta save... Or who are we trying to stop? Reach the intercept point before Clements. Ah! Okay, I guess now we'll wait for our next objective. And while we're doing that... Oh, we discovered a recipe book. Cool. Defeat Clements. We got three minutes to do it. But we have all these generals and whatnot that I really would like their skill cards. We need to get that recipe book as well. Where'd everyone go? There you are. Hi, guys. If I could have another rush, that would be like Christmas morning. At least from the generals. The generals will have stuff, for sure. There we go. 
All right. No, there's Mars Bond Cacheta. There's one in every battle. There's a rush zone. Well, we'll just charge. I'm going to end that. And you, that's cool. We can actually end those early. I'm going to rush up here and grab the recipe book. You can see that glowing green. And that was what I was saying earlier. I think we missed quite a few recipe books. I think we did what we needed to do to unlock them. But unfortunately, we just never actually picked them up. Heavy shield, Captain. We'll leave you alone. Successfully did a pincer attack. All right. And now look at all these guys fresh for the taking. And this is one of those situations where the young lions get to learn a lesson in humility because they almost got completely decimated if it wasn't for Daryun showing up with his troops and saving the day. So a little bit of humble pie for them is not a bad thing. Let's take care of all these assault captains. And elite guard. We still got a minute 32. All right, we should be good now. And it looks like Tus and Zarafan and them are actually laying the hurt on him as well. We haven't actually got to play with Zarafan. I had an opportunity during that free mode battle, but I just chose to go with Isfan instead because I wanted to see his uh, martial arts. But this actually should be, oh man, they are juggling him. Look at that. This is like them, <laughs> this is like the three brothers fighting Lu Bu at Hulao Gate, only Clems is not making a good showing for himself. But we gotta hurry. We only got a few... We got 52 seconds to pull this off. So this is probably gonna be a D ranking, but it's alright. Where'd you go? <laughs> Clements! There you are. You're up in the air. C ranking. That was one of those things we couldn't have messed around with the assault captains and the defense captains. We would have ran out of time. So it's a good thing we did what we did. Arslan <laughs> Now, if Arslan just being alive wasn't infuriating enough for Silver Mask, for uh, Hilmes, or Hermes as he's known in the anime, Arslan actually leading a successful army and being a threat to him is even worse. And looks like Silver Mask is going to take matters into his own hands and head to the keep of Saint Emmanuel to take Arslan's head himself, which is kind of respectable. At least he didn't send a lot of those shadow um, sorcerers to try and do it. He's going to, uh, he wants to cut the head off of the Upsurper himself. So that kind of tells you something about Silver Mask's character. But we're going to go ahead. We're in the vicinity of the keep of Saint Emmanuel, and we will see what happens in the next episode. Hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you liked the episode, go ahead and click like down below, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, that'd be a big help, and we'll see you next time. Later days, everyone.